Today, the man accused of shooting at a mosque in Meriden returns to the courtroom. Ted Hakey Jr. is charged with a federal hate crime in that case. He's been held in jail without bail. Prosecutors argued he is just too dangerous. Today, his lawyer expected to address those claims. News aide Kent Pierce is live outside of the federal courthouse in New Haven this morning with the latest. Kent. And Keith, the last time Ted Hakey Jr. was here in New Haven Federal Court, the federal prosecutor read a bunch of his Facebook posts and seemed to indicate that Hakey thought all Muslims were terrorists. Well, the leaders of that mosque in Meriden, though, say firing several bullets into their prayer room was the real terrorist act here. That happened back in November, just hours after the terror attacks in Paris. Hakey admits that he went into his backyard, fired off two different guns, and sent several rounds into the Baitul Aman Mosque next door. Hakey told investigators he was aiming for a wood pile in his yard and missed. But then they look into his Facebook posts and found all of that hateful and threatening statements about Muslims. Leaders of that mosque invited us to early morning prayers on Friday, and they say they wish they'd done more to talk to neighbors like Hakey. If we had perhaps maybe done a better job in reaching out, uh, his, uh, we, would, we would have or we could have perhaps potentially changed his viewpoint. Well, they are doing more now, inviting the whole community to come to Friday afternoon services. They say Hakey himself is welcome to come to the mosque. That is, if he ever gets out of jail. Prosecutors say he is too dangerous to be allowed out on bail. A hearing to determine that started two weeks ago today. Hakey's attorney asked to postpone his part of that hearing for a week because he wasn't ready. Then that got postponed another week through the holidays. That hearing is scheduled to resume later on today. We're live outside New Haven Federal Court. I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.